Hello everyone, I'm going to give you a short tutorial on how to create basic shapes in Desmos using straight lines. So in Desmos, on the left is where we enter all the equations for our straight lines. We can also click the plus button for a few more options. We will be using the table. And if you click on the spanner here, here are all your settings that you can play around with. Now I will be making a triangle in this region of my Cartesian plane just to keep all the numbers positive so let's get into it now a horror let's start with a horizontal line every horizontal line has an equation y equals some number so I'm going to type in I'm going to zoom in a little bit and I'm going to type in 1 y equals 1 now this line goes forever but I don't want it to go forever. I'm going to tell Desmos to restrict my domain. What that means is uh, enter in, put in all the values of x that I want to see this line from. So open up a parentheses here and type in, and I'm sure you'll find all these symbols, um, 1 less than, and then press equals to turn it into a less than or equal to sign, type in X and then do the same thing. And let's say I want to go to six. So this is going to be the base of my triangle and it has a length of five. Easy. Now let's type in an equation for another side. We're going to do a vertical line here and every vertical line has an equation X equals something x equals, let's go x equals 1, and this is going to be the makings of the second side of my triangle. Now I need to tell Desmos to now limit my range, so all the y values that I want to see for this line. I can see that I need to start at y equals 1, because anything below that is not going to help with making my triangle. and. Let's say I only want a length of 3 here, so I'm going to go from 1 to 4, and there is the second side of my triangle. Now, let's create the hypotenuse using a, another line. What we'll need to do is insert a table. In this table, we're going to type in the two points that we want to connect. So you can click and drag to see the points that lie on either of your lines and we're going to go all the way to the end I know it's obvious as well so we're going to type in 1 4 and we're going to type in 6 1 and then we're going to join these points by doing this so see this button next to Y1 you can also do that to your other um, lines as well and you can click and hold to get some options so we're going to click and hold on this one to bring up some options and then we're just going to turn the lines on and ta-da finished let's change the color as well green all right very simple very straightforward and finally how can you draw or label your diagram you can't do that on Desmos, you have to export it. So we're going to hide everything except the figure. Click share graph, click export image, uh, leave all this and download as PNG. What that does is save it as a picture and then you can draw and label this. Once you've done that, you can insert your diagram figure into your uh, into your report that's it nice and easy if you have any questions please let us know